I am Shifa from Hacktify Cyber Security. Today in this video I am going to explain about one more bug bounty tip and we are going to implement it together. So let's quickly get started. Okay so this is a tip that I am going to be explaining you all today and we are going to also implement this tip. So here this tip is about Google dorking and it is going to help us find out some hidden bug bounty programs. So as you can see the tip is given also the Google Dork which will help us find out lesser known targets so that we will find much less crowd than the crowdsourced platforms. So let's quickly go down and see the analytics of the tweet. So I see that it has more than 72,000 views and it also has a lot of comments and uh, more than 300 likes. So let's quickly go. Uh, you can select this uh, Google Doc and open in your browser. As you can see that once I open this in browser, I am able to see a lot of results, which I was also able to estimate based on the response this tweet already has. So I am so excited to uh, implement this. As I see that I got a lot of results. H&M is also one of them on which I have already done a lot of hunting. So let me go to quickly a security page of H&M and as I go down, I can see the table. H&M pays up to 1500 euros for the high bug, up to 800 euros for medium and so on. Let's quickly go back and see more results. So you can go and check out all the given targets one by one. Uh, when I go here, I can also see that this program also is on bug crowd, which can be seen from here. So a lot of results are been appeared after completing, uh, up after completely writing this Google Doc, I got a lot of the results. So this tip actually works and uh, this is super simple to implement. You don't need to do any setup or configurations. You can just quickly copy paste this Google Doc in your Chrome and you will get a lot of results. Okay, so once I go back, I can see a follow up tweet with the same tweet, uh, which says that you can also download Alexa top 1 million websites uh, with the help of any fuzzing tool. You can also find out the security.txt endpoint. And finally, you will get a lot of bug bounty private programs results. So I think this tweet would be done thinking that a lot of websites are not been crawled or the security.txt endpoint is not crawled every time. It takes some time for the crawler to crawl the results. So if you don't want to wait for the crawlers to crawl and initially you want to find out uh, more targets, then you can also use the fuzzing technique. So let's quickly go and implement this technique as well. So let me go down and see the analytics of this tweet as well. I can see a good response on this tweet. So let's quickly get started. First of all, we need to download Alexa top 1 million websites. So you can just go select this and try to search it in Google. So I got the first result, which is Kaggle. I'll go there and I can download the Alexa top 1 million websites from here. I have already downloaded it. So I'll quickly go unzip and the next step is to fuzz. Now I can go to my terminal and quickly check the list that I have already downloaded. So it has 1 million results as expected. But what I can also see is the numbering which is added with this list a comma and a white space which I am supposed to remove before giving it to any fuzzing tool. So now what I am going to do is I am going to take help of SED and AWK in order to remove the unwanted things like numbers, comma and white space. Uh, so here is my command. If you don't know what AWK and SED is, you may check out my video which I have already created on SED and AWK. Here I am using SED to remove the white space and AWK is going to help me uh, take the right hand side which is the domain part from the entire long uh, string. So now I am going to go and hit the result. Currently I am taking head which is used to see only the top 10 results 
and on the top 10 results my command works perfectly fine so i'm going to go and use it entirely on the entire file before that i am going to go and download one tool which is httpx from github so in order to download this tool you need to go to github you can go to the latest releases and you can get the version suitable to your system configuration so i am going to go down and on the right hand side we are going to find out this releases you can click on that once you go down you can find out the suitable version currently i am on mac os so i am going to be selecting the mac uh, one if you are on windows or linux you can do the same let's go back to the terminal now as we have already seen that the tool is downloaded so i'm going to just check if it works so yeah this tool is completely downloaded and is working now before giving the input to the tool we need to do couple of steps uh, which is to filter the result we need to remove all the numerical values white space and comma uh, on the entire file currently i have only tested it for the top 10 result so now i am going to change this head to cat and i am also going to save it in a file okay so now i am going to give this file a file name which is top 1 million sorted.txt and i also want to see the result on screen along with saving the results in the txt file so i'll use the command t and hit enter so now i can also see the results on screen and as well as it is saved in my file now i'm going to clear the screen i am going to read this top 1 million sorted file and then i am just going to do a normal word count to see how many lines are there so i can see 1 million uh, websites or domains are added into this file now i am going to quickly go and use this httpx and i am going to pass a list with the help of hyphen l and i am going to pass the entire 1 million list after doing that i am going to give a path which is the endpoint where i want every uh, domain to hit so this is a particular endpoint that i am interested in i am going to match the code which is 200 ok only when i get the 200 ok result i want to see the response uh, let's quickly go and wait for the results so i hope you all are able to understand the entire command and i have also started getting the results uh, as you can see on my screen i have started getting a lot of security.txt files from alexa 1 million websites which i have uh, downloaded okay guys, so i hope you all enjoyed watching this video and we were able to successfully implement both the tweet that means both of them are complete reality and you will be able to implement this tweet and find out a lot of bug bounty hidden secret private programs and you can start your bug bounty hunting journey i wish you all the best for your hunting and thank you so much for watching this video